My name is James Opanro Kanaris, a student in Besbury Academy. I'm from T. Okay. So first of all, I want to know how it feels. I want to know your feeling, how you're feeling right now. Because tomorrow is a grand finale. How is it feeling like making it to the finals of the junior science and math quiz? Derek, let me start with you. Okay, so first of all, uh, I'm very excited to be uh, in the finals of the GSMQ uh, once more again. I'm very excited, but the thing is sometimes uh, you feel nervous because yes. you don't know what's going to happen. Exactly. That, that's, the, that's the thing. Mm. So but you are excited, overall, but you are I'm nervous. Excited, yes. That's a normal feeling. Okay. So let's, let's speak to Edmond. Let me see how he's also feeling. I'm also excited because mm. making it to the final is not for uh, anybody or any school. Yes, and it is, and because my dreams has also come to, yes, it is my dream to oh, be in the finals of okay. this competition. So when we started the competition, we're dreaming that you get to be in the finals. Yes. It's a dream come true, eh? Yes. I'm also excited for you as well. Rhoda, how are you feeling? I am feeling as the guys like it's a good feeling um this is not our first time in the quiz so having to come back is a like it makes me proud of okay. myself and of my fellow quiz but is it the first time contesting for your school yes please okay but you've been a supporter of your school in subsequent in years past yes nice one let me know how it feels As to be in the final sad. you are sad why are you sad I'm sad. Why are you sad? Let us know. I felt difficult to um, couldn't answer any question. Come again. I felt difficult to um, answer any question. You felt it difficult yes. to answer some questions yes. in the semi final. Uh, yes. Which question was that? When was that? Nobel Prize. Nobel Prize. Yes. So you have in fact I occupied a busy schedule to study all the Nobel Prize there. And the discovery is here. Yes. But to no I couldn't even answer any question. But I'm oh, sad. Oh. But I know that has passed. Now you are moving to the final, so. And I'm asking how you are feeling. If you put a, the sadness into the finals, you know you won't really survive. So you need to get rid of the sadness you are feeling. Oh? Okay. So I need you to cheer up before tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'll come and look at you and see if you're excited or not. Okay, but I want to know your favorite contest throughout the journey, from prelims up to the semi-finals. Which one was your favorite? Which one was the toughest for you? I want to know. Let me start with um, Rhoda. Rhoda, tell us. Your favorite contest, the toughest contest for you. So my favorite contest was yesterday. That was the um, semi-finals. Yes. Yeah. Like, it was really good watching my fellow colleagues answer the questions very well. Yeah. Like, they gave you a contest. They gave you a top yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. They answered very well. Mm. Like they performed very well. And which one was your toughest contest? So like, they gave you a run for your money. Mm. So, I haven't, like, we, we were seated. So we began from the um, quarterfinals. Yes. So I haven't yet experienced like any tough contest. Yet. So so far you've been having a cool. Yeah, not really really cool, but it's been cool. Okay, okay, that's a brilla speaking by the way. Let's speak to the guys. Let me know your favorite contest and the toughest contest so far. My favorite contest and the toughest contest was. The quarterfinals. Okay. My With which school? Best brain. With which school? Uh, give praise and give praise and task school. Yes, get school. It was very tough, eh? Yes, tough. Very but which tough. one too was your favorite? Or it was the same one? The same one. It was your favorite and your toughest. Yes. Was it during the I I mean that time there's no Nobel Prize. So how did it become your toughest and your favorite at the same time? There, there was no more prize. There was no more prize in the yes. quarterfinals. Yes. Okay, so when you came, it was very tough for you. Yes. Okay. Let me know from Edmond. Your favorite and your toughest? Um, my favorite is uh, the quarterfinals versus uh, give praise and guitar school. 
This is because uh, we had a very high point. Mm. Yes. Mm. Mm. And my toughest contest, I have not experienced. And then maybe, experience maybe tomorrow is going to be. Maybe, <laughs> maybe, maybe. Derek, let's hear from you. Okay, so my favorite contest, I also go for yesterday's contest. That mm. is against Woodbridge and uh, M.A. Creek, yes. With that, uh, with yesterday's contest, actually the speedways, it was very exciting to watch, yes. We did very well, so it makes me uh, proud. Uh, yes, it was actually my favorite. And actually for the mm, toughest contest, I'll go for, I'll go for, I'll go for maybe, okay, yesterday's content, of course. Actually, we were leading, but at a certain point, that is the round four, round five, we mm -hmm. didn't achieve any point, mm -hmm. zero. So <laughs> it could have been that we could have catch up with us. Yes, anything could have happened. Okay. Edmond is saying that maybe the finals. Yeah, maybe tomorrow is going to be our mm -hmm. toughest contest. Mm -hmm. mm, after all, it's the finals and finals. Anything mm. can happen. Everyone is prepared to win the contest. So I think tomorrow's contest is going to be uh, the toughest for us. And actually, we are expecting that our opposing uh, schools are going to give out their best. So we also try to give out our best. Okay. So Edmond, let us know your expectation for tomorrow's contest. Um, I expect nothing but the best. And also, what will come should come because a final of competition is a final yes and finals are um, always uh, the toughest part of every competition yes and so i expect our opponent to put up their best and you, you expect your opponents to put up their best what and about you yes, <laughs> because if you're expecting them to come with their best you need to be prepared to meet them yes. because they're also preparing to meet you and we will we'll face them with. A win is a win. Yes. It's anybody's win, right? Yes. Okay. So let me speak to Rhoda. Your expectation for tomorrow's contest? So I expect to be part of a very competitive um, contest. I know that all our competitors are preparing very well, and I want to see the result of their preparations tomorrow, and also want to see the result of our preparations too. Looks like most of you are interested in what's actually going to happen with the other teams and yourself as well. You are all ready to see what happens tomorrow. So let's know your expectations. Okay, I expect that uh, tomorrow's contest. Uh, you have no expectations? I have expectations. Let us know your expectations. Uh, I expect. Oh, you are so sad. No. Okay. I'm confused. <laughs> you are sad and confused at the same time. Yes. I think your coordinator should be taking notes of this. He needs a lot of counseling before tomorrow so that he'll be able to put up his best performance. Yes. Okay. But let's, let's zoom into your career path. I want to know what you want to be in future. Because you guys are very intelligent, very brilliant, and I want to know what you wish to be in future. In future, I want to be a doctor, a professional doctor. A professional doctor. Yes. Oh, that's impressive. I wish you all the best. Thanks. Let's get to Rhoda. What would you want to be? So I want to be a surgeon. A surgeon? Yes. Hmm. In a is it in a particular field, like a brain surgeon or something? Yeah, yeah, a brain surgeon. Mm, a neurosurgeon. Yes. Interesting. Yes. Edmund. I want to be a teacher in the future. A teacher? Yes. Oh, that's so wonderful. So maybe in the future you'll be training some students to yes. also compete in their schools. Yes. Beautiful. Derek, what do you want to be? I prefer, I want to be a lecturer in the future. You want to be a lecturer? Yes. So just like Edmund. Yes. Teacher, lecturer. Okay, that's very interesting. Interesting feels from all of you. Finally, is there any special shout out you want to give to somebody? Either your teachers, your parents who have supported you so far, any special words for anybody? Let me start with James. Okay, first of all, first of, I would thank 
uh, in my school teachers who probably help us to learn effectiveness. Thereby, I will uh, 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 you are still trying to remember the people you want to thank. Should yes. I go and come back? Yes. Okay. Rhoda, let us know any special shout outs to anybody. So, I'll thank um, my family for always encouraging me to learn hard and go for it. And also, our teachers who have trained us very well to um, give out our best in this contest. And like everyone who is supporting our school, our proprietor, our headmaster, like everyone, everyone, nice. everyone who supports. Okay, Edmund, any special shout out? Um, I'll first of all thank uh, our teachers who, are, who have been training us for this competition. They have been spending a lot of their time and energy uh, training us for this big moment. Yes, and also, I also thank my parents. They've been always advising me to learn, learn how in order to um, do good in this competition. Okay, so Derek, any special shout out? Okay, so first of all, I'll thank uh, our school headmaster, the director of the school, and also second, uh, I'm going to thank our teachers, those who train us, those who are training us for this contest. Actually, they, they've been spending a lot of their time and energy Yes, training us for this contest, uh, and it is uh, the reason why, yeah, the reason why we are up to uh, this level. And yes, actually, um, I really appreciate that all what they've been doing, and also I'll thank uh, all my family members for all the support they've been giving me, uh, moral training also. Yes. Okay, so it was actually wonderful talking to you guys, getting to know your favorite and your toughest moments on the competition so far and i wish you the best tomorrow thanks i thanks. wish you the best and we are hoping that the best school actually wins for 2025 junior science and maths quiz so this has been our time with the finals and we had best brain academy here very soon we'll be having good shepherd rcjhs and emmanuel methodist join us for their interview but don't forget that the Junior Science and Maths Quiz is proudly supported by the KNUSD Learning Center, IDL KNUSD, DEX Technologies, in collaboration with Eridek Ghana, the College of Science, the College of Engineering at KNUSD, with Ghana Education Service as our key partners, and with sponsorship from Gridco, MTN Stakeholders Management, Nestle Ghana Limited, Diopta I Consult, and Helimanuel Cakes and Catering Services. Thank you for joining us. We'll go for a quick commercial break. We'll be right back.